Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. My name is Jalal Ahmad and in this tutorial we will be learning about the update part of our CRUD series which we just started uh, earlier in this series. So for that purpose I would, I would like to take a button that is in here and we'll name it as update. So double click or right click on this button and come to action and action performed method so where is that is in here we will write uh, string is we, we can also write a method for this purpose and we can also write uh, the code in this uh, in this the action perform method in here so i would like to write the code in here so string sql is equal to um, update sorry update and uh, table name is fees not the fees that is users and uh, update fees update sorry <laughs> this fees is a table uh, which i am developing for a project um, i am developing a project for school so I made a table with the name fees so that's why I'm remembering that name and writing and um, saying it in here again and again so that's uh, the reason so in here our table name is users so I will write users and uh, we will write set Come on. okay now the field name uh, which we will mention in here first one is f name l name father city and country so first name is f name equal to so take variable name that is f name copy it and paste it in here and get text from that okay it's done now and now okay now just click here uh, press here uh, enter button and now come to towards this part Second one is LM and I will write it as LM that is get text LM this LM is the is the J text field name of uh, this is the LM so I write here LM as I remember it already okay now just copy and paste these lines so that we can save our time just we will change the name of our text fields so third field is uh, father and right here the name is father and similarly the text field name is also here is the father similarly here is city and here the field name is also city here is the field name is country and the field name for here is also as country and the remaining last line is remove this comma and now write the where condition that is id is equal to now where from we will take this id so this the combo box that is copy its name and come here where the id is equal to paste it get selected item and to string 
where id is equal to the selected item of j combo box so this was our query and now we will run our write the try catch block sorry try catch block and uh, write the PST equal to con dot prepare statement and now we will execute this so execute and if it is running successfully j option pen dot show message dialog so prompt us a message it says record updated successfully okay and if there is any error so prompt us a message which just says about the required about the relevant exception so this was about the update part and now we will uh, press shift f6 to execute this file and uh, you can see so just click this one and you can see abc 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 and pakistan okay click update and you can see record updated successfully and you can see it is not updating in here so we will write uh, the method in here which updates the table and that method is uh, update table i have written it already in copy and paste it in here already in this series uh, i will show you this method that is updating uh, the table the j table so press shift f6 to run this file and now press uh, this one is I'm putting a dummy data so that we can uh, understand it quickly just look at this for and you can see update and it is updating so this was about this tutorial and we will be learning about the next tutorial uh, about in the next tutorial about this update um, as we faced a problem in here and because we uh, updated this ID and it was uh, not updated which when we re-executed this file so stay tuned for the next tutorial and if you like my videos please uh, hit like button and red comment and subscribe my channel thanks for now